fridge and freezer the most essential cabinets in every kitchen in every household well in my kitchen on my yes on my right is the fridge and on my left is the freezer yes they are not integrated fridge and freezer stand alone in my kitchen in today's video i will be showing what i have in my fridge and how i keep my fridge organized we at home eat lots of fruits lots of veggies and lots of nuts So let me show you what I have in my refrigerator for this week and the way I shop and the way I organize my fridge. I carry these cotton bags with me and most importantly the food bags what I have switched to replacing the plastic bags of the supermarket which are of different dimensions and of different styles. A few of them are netted while others are completely covered. They have a string to secure and to tighten. I will leave a link in the description box of this set of cotton bags which I bought online. I also have a pack of three fully recyclable, machine washable, BPA free polyester bags to store fruits and veggies. Now I picked up this particular set from a local store. Most of the supermarkets these days are selling these reusable bags which you can find it at ease and start using. When I said to the supermarket to do my weekly shopping, I make sure to take them. Firstly, it saves me up of not taking or pulling any plastic bags to pack my veggies. Um, I, normally, I normally do my household shopping every week. Well, at times, I've got to admit, if I missed something, then I do go back. Or, um, if I crave to eat something and that one particular vegetable, which is a must, which is needed, and if it's not in the refrigerator, then yes, I do go back for shopping again. And most importantly, the food bags that I have switched to. And I don't have to pull up those plastic bags of the supermarket anymore. I'm back from my shopping and let me show you what I have bought and the way I have packed my fruits and vegetables. I've packed all my leafy vegetables in these opaque bags. Coriander, curry leaves, dill leaves. If I store in the leafy vegetables in these netted bags, I noticed they do get dry up very fast. So that's the reason I have my leafy vegetables in these opaque bags and the netted bags, I use them to store in different vegetables such as tomatoes, carrots, peppers, beetroots, aubergine and, and raw bananas. So this is my shopping and I will show you how I get these fruits and vegetables what I have been shopping in my fridge. Just a few preps what I do as I come back home from shopping. Any kind of leafy vegetables that I pick, I make sure to discard the thick woody stems which makes it a lot easy and saves up time during the weekdays. I also make sure to take out the stock of fresh green chilies, which can be preserved for longer. So basically, I kind of tidy up the veggies before they are stacked up in the fridge, which in a way helps me in maintaining the cleanliness of the fridge. And these lemon, lime and orange wire bags are definitely a no-no to enter into the fridge. When opened, there are little bits of wire which keeps coming out, adding on more cleaning work later. I prefer to transfer them straight away into my cloth bags after my shopping. Uh, maybe not very pleasing to the eyes, but um, it's a very practical looking refrigerator what I have on a daily basis. Now I do end up having small portions of leftovers and the top shelf is always for leftovers. It could be dal, rice, kichdi. Today I have kale rice and white rice. I always store what is cooked either in porcelain, glass or steel containers. Now, there are many odd shapes such as these ones. In order to close them, I have a pack of multi-size, reusable, washable, microwavable, dishwasher safe, silicone lids which are stretchable and can take the shape of either fruits, vessels, containers, cups, mugs. 
keeping the food more fresh and easy for storage instead of using the cling film every time. I also ensure the top shelf to store in my pressure cooker gasket. Keeping them in the refrigerator extends a longer life of the gaskets is what I have noticed over the years. In the next shelf, I have a pack of juice and bags filled in with vegetables. In fact, most of the shelves are filled with fruits and vegetables than pre-cooked or store-bought food. To be honest, I cook almost on a daily basis using fresh vegetables just the right amount rather than in bulk cooking. Vegetables like beans bought from superstores are pre-packed in plastic bags and I think they really need to work on their packing. Now in this bowl, I store in squeezed and freshly cut lemon and lime wedges. And this bowl is not covered with the lid with the main objective of keeping the refrigerator smelling good with the freshness of lime. As a family, we all just love eating fruits. We are fruit lovers. Oranges, apples, melon are a must to have on a regular basis. And when it comes to storing certain things for long lasting, I make sure to use steel containers or reusable glass containers. I always ensure to have unsalted butter in the refrigerator to make ghee, clarified butter at home. And plum tomatoes for salad covered to retain freshness. The bottom two shelves are mainly organized for kids to reach out with ease their favorites such as smoothies, yogurt pouches, spreads and chocolates. The basket in the fridge is mainly for delicates, wherein I make sure to keep soft things such as tomatoes and all kinds of leafy vegetables which have their own space and don't get squished with others. The bottom shelf of the fridge doors are again kids' favourites, flavoured yogurts and cheese. I have always got green chilli paste on hand which I make at home, store it and use it in almost all the dishes I cook. Alopinos on hand to spice up and just a few essential sauces, oats milk and milk bottles, few more fizzy cans just as a backup when we have friends visiting us, flavouring agents and colours. Having all the fruits and vegetables needed in the refrigerator, keeping the fridge organised in a healthy way leads one to live an easy day and a better life. Shop fresh, store fresh, cook on a daily basis whatever you can. Stay healthy and be happy. Take care everyone. Bye for now. If you would like to see what's in my kitchen, the way I have organized my kitchen and would want me to do a kitchen tour, then leave me a comment in the comment section below. I would love to do a kitchen tour.